So for me, Black Pride is like I said, doing what you can to just soldier on. And even that soldiering may be minute. So you may only have to take a baby step today, but you could run a mile tomorrow. And as long as you just have that belief and you just have that spirit at your core, you will be all right. And I've seen that in my family. I've seen that with my grandparents, with my family, you know, with my parents. You know, you, you, to me, that's what Black pride is, is that, that intrepidness of spirit. And I know other races have that and other races have been through many atrocities. I don't want to, I don't want to take away from that. Yeah. But I'm not a part of those races. I'm part of me. And when it, you ask me, why are you proud to be Black? And I said, it's because of that spirit. It's yeah. because, woo, it's so many times, so many times when we could have just, you know, jumped into the river, we stayed on the boat yeah. and we kept rolling on the river to use the, pro- yeah. the proud Mary analogy. Why do you think your dad wanted you and your siblings to, what, what was it that he had you say, I'm black and I'm, say it loud, I'm black, and I'm black and I'm proud, is that? Well, that happened, yes. So to give you a bit of context, I was older, so I had a disconnected relationship with my father. And I remember that particular experience when I was older, like in teen years, uh, and sitting around with my younger siblings and I was there for a visit, you know, you go visit your dad when your parents are separated. Uh, for him, I can't speak to his motivation, but what he co- communicated to me in his lifetime, he's now deceased, communicated to me in his lifetime that it was important for us to have a sense of, of, of gravity, of not only what we've been through, but also what we're capable of. And, and no one that, and no one can take any of that away from you. So no matter how a white person treats you or says, says anything to you or whatever, like no one can take the very essence of you away. And the very essence of you is at least in the physical manifestation of yourself is that you are black. Many people are going to look at you and they're going to see a quote unquote black person, African-American, whatever. And with that, that's a part of the other, the message from him, they're going to bring all sorts of opinions and expectations of you. And what you have to say, irrespective of all of those things, is that I'm the best of myself and I'm proud of it. So call me whatever, you know, negative thing you want, but I'm the best of myself and I'm proud of it. And also no one should be not proud of their journey. And part of their journey, part of your journey as a black person is being black and at least from a peripheral perspective, having to endure some of the things that black people endured. I mean, Jim Crow laws applied to everybody who was black. Like you were, whether whether you wanted to be a part of it or not, you were a part of it. If you looked like you were part of the African diaspora. Yeah. Yeah, that's all making sense. So you're you're perceived in a certain way. You um, have, there's associations that come along with defining you, others defining you as a black person. And so I hear four things now around this. One is the collective part of it, the building of community, like we're in it together. Um, and the way to define the way you are together is, you know, with different complexions, of course, being black. Um, second is um, a sense of resilience that you mentioned, which is like kind of remembering the challenges you've been through and being proud of the way those challenges are taken on. And then the third and fourth are kind of education processes. One is education. It sounds like almost educating yourself. Like you're going to have so many people throw negative associations your way. You remember who you are. You remember. Yes. Your, yes. You remember you're all these positive things, mm-hmm. not the things they try to tell you you are. To watch the rest of that episode, go ahead and click the video below me. To see a different compelling Healing Race episode, you can click the video below me. We look forward to seeing you in the next video.